INHP's mission is to increase affordable and sustainable housing opportunities and to serve as a catalyst for the redevelopment and revitalization of Indianapolis neighborhoods. INHP offers a variety of programs to first-time homebuyers. It really depends on if the first-time homebuyer is considered to be mortgage ready or not. We offer homeownership advising and homebuyer education, as well as financial literacy on understanding one's credit, establishing a personal budget, and then providing a general overview of the home buying process itself. INHP used analysis from the Indiana University Public Policy Institute and also received help from local community development partners to identify five focus areas. These focus areas are Inglewood, Mapleton Fall Creek, St. Clair Place, Riverside, and Crown Hill. So the Crown Hill is one of four neighborhoods that comprise the great place we know as Maple Crossing. There are 50 new homes in planning or production right now, all being built in the Crown Hill neighborhood. Midtown Anchor Coalition is a coalition of institutions in the education, arts, and cultural sector here in Midtown. Those institutions have essentially come together to improve not only the experience at their institutions, but the communities that surround them. Our work here is to serve as a convener in areas of entrepreneurship, in business and commerce, and helping ensure that the services that are available to the surrounding neighborhoods are those that residents need. INHP has a long and successful history of working with the Flanner House. The Flanner House is one of the city's oldest community centers. Flanner House was designed in 1898 uh, with the idea of being an organization that would work directly with the black community uh, to move people from a position of instability to a position of self-reliance and self-determination. We have an early childhood program. Uh, we are a center for working family site. We are a United Way agency. We also have a senior citizens center. In addition to that, we operate a program called FEED. It stands for Farming, Education, Employment, and Distribution. We are standing in the middle of the largest food desert, not only in Indianapolis, but in the entire state. So we simultaneously tackle food security in the neighborhood, in the community, while at the same time doing crime prevention by employing young men and women from the neighborhood. Near East Area Renewal goes by NEAR, and we serve the near east side of Indianapolis. We are a resident-based, nonprofit community development corporation. We work at trying to invigorate business development in our community, housing development in our community, and really look at what we can do to make this a better place to live. NEAR has worked with the Indianapolis Public Schools and Charter Schools to begin to think about ways that we could encourage educators to live in the district that they work in. We've been developing the Educators Village, which is a, a development of 22 affordable homes, mostly on Rural Street between 10th Street and St. Clair. Down payment assistance program that's offered through INHP is a real incentive for teachers to buy here rather than elsewhere. It really transforms our community and gives a great value and great opportunity for housing for local urban teachers. So the Anchor Housing Program is an, an initiative brought forth through the Indy Chamber uh, in which INHP and local employers are partners. The program is really designed to encourage employees uh, to live closer to where they work. The Anchor Housing Program was a great opportunity for us because, you know, being so young, being a, a newlywed couple and being hopeful and starting a family, it gave us a great opportunity to buy our first home. Families aren't going to live in a neighborhood that isn't good for families. We found the perfect starter home. Um, it's like just the right size. It kind of sounded too good to be true, um, but we were really glad it wasn't. It puts us in a really great position going forward for our family and for our marriage.